we're back at Big Tuna. Uh, <laughs> I already messed up again. I already messed up right in the beginning. All right, three, two, one. Big Tuna Sushi in Chico, California, and today we have Nicole from Anderson Valley Brewery, and she's going to go over uh, some of the uh, backstory of Anderson Valley and uh, their flagship beers and some uh, new beers that they have in store for us today. Hi all, so super excited to be out here in Chico. Um, Anderson Valley, we're in Boonville, California, so we're in Mendocino County, basically between Fort Bragg and Ukiah. Um, so it's a little bit of a drive out here, but um, beautiful day. Um, we were basically established in 1987, and at that time we were one of the first 10 craft breweries in the US. So we've been around for quite a while. Um, today, I'm drinking our flagship beer. It's our Boont Amber. Um, super easy, smooth, malty, um, easy drinking, 5.8% uh, alcohol. Um, pairs super well with all the sushi um, on the menu. And um, we also brought our new crisp IPA. So this is a West Coast IPA with Amarillo, Chinook, hops in there. Um, so. We're featuring those guys right now, and we've got a couple other beers on tap here, too. Excellent. Cheers. Cheers. Let's give them a taste. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah, it's easy, huh? Very good. Can you tell us a little bit more about your flagship beer? Was that the first beer that you established? This or? is. This is our first beer that we established at Anderson Valley. Um, a lot of people have had it way in the past and it's nice to get it on your palate again because mm -hmm. they said, I think this is one of the first craft beers I've ever had was the Boon to Amber. Um, and just to have it again and people are like, oh, I've missed that beer a lot. Mm -hmm. um, but you can find it in a lot of the grocery stores, um, bars, restaurants, and um, it should be everywhere. Awesome. And uh, this crisp IPA, uh, this just recently came out, brand new to the show. Yeah, so we're not a huge IPA brewery, so we decided this year we're going to actually do a rotating IPA series. So this guy came out in uh, January, and it'll go until the end of March, and then each quarter we'll come out with a different IPA. So the next one after the crisp IPA will be a double IPA. Beautiful. Yeah, so it's just something kind of fun. Awesome, very cool. Well, uh, I've never made it out to Anderson Valley Brewery before. Do you want to tell us a little bit about uh, that brewery? And, yeah, uh, absolutely. What kind of things you have going on over there? So we're on 29 acres. Um, it's a destination point. So we've got an 18-hole disc golf course. Um, we also turned it into a beer park. So we have the licensing throughout the 28 uh, acres that you can take your beer out, play disc golf. Um, so that's awesome and fun. Um, also, what's nice about it, too, is we're dog and kid friendly. Um, on the weekends, we'll have music and food trucks. And um, everybody's going to want to know about our Boonville Brew Festival. That's it's what I wanted to know. It hasn't about. happened because of COVID for years. So this year, it's going to be April 23rd. So that's our biggest fundraiser in the Valley. And that brings about 7,000 people into Boonville. And Boonville basically is 1,000 people. So um, it's a great time. It's a two-day camping event. Um, people show up on Friday and parties at a camp. And then Saturday's the beer festival all day at the fairgrounds. And then people um, are welcome to camp at the fairgrounds. It's free because um, we don't want nobody drinking and driving. Um, but we're super excited this year to have it back. Yeah, it sounds amazing. Yeah, it's a great time. You should come out. Well, definitely go. I'm definitely going to try to make it out. Sweet. Like out there. Um, the other thing we're really proud of, too, is uh, we're solar powered at the brewery. So, um, Very nice. yeah, so that's, we're actually one of the first okay. solar power breweries. 
um, in the U.S. So that's a great, great point too. That's outstanding. Yeah, bring the wife and the kids out there too. Yes, please do. <laughs> and the disc golf. Yes. Well, and if you don't have uh, a frisbee or disc golf, they have them at the tap room too. All right. That sounds amazing. Yeah. Well, thank you, Nicole, for coming tonight, and uh, let's have a good tap takeover. Yes. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks for having us, Big Tuna. Uh -huh.